Today we will be going over what's called a snake break. here and welcome to Bochi Not Macrame. Today we will be going over what's called a snake braid. So this pattern looks best when you use two different colors to weave them together so that you see the two tone sides. What's great about braids and sennets is that you can use them on almost any macrame design. They make great plant hanger posts, keychains, wall hanging layers and much more. If you guys are interested in learning more macrame knots and sennets, we do have a downloadable 50 knots and sennets ebook over on bochinot.com. So if you guys are interested in downloading that, you guys can head on over there. And with that said, let's get right into it. To demonstrate this knot pattern, I've attached two strands of 200 centimeter long cords onto a dowel with lark's head knots. To start the snake braid, all we have to do is take the far left cord, wrap it over to the right side, through to the back, and over to the left. Now take the far right cord, and we're going to also bring it to the back and over the far left cord. So as you can see, my blue cord is above the beige cord on the left side. Now take that blue cord end and pull it through the loop on the right side. Pull on both cord ends to tighten. And now you have completed one knot out of this snake braid sennet. So now we're going to repeat the same thing again. Take that far left cord over to the right, wrap it around through to the back, take the far right cord to the back and over the far left cord. Then pull the same cord through the loop on the right. Continue repeating this pattern below until you have reached your desired length. Once you have made the same knot several times, this is what the snake braid should look like. And that's a wrap with the snake braid pattern. What did you guys think of this? Let me know in the comment section below. I do find that this one is pretty easy to make since all you have to do is wrap the cords around and pull them through. So it's not a very difficult braid, which is great if you're looking for something simple to incorporate into your projects. If you guys are interested in learning and designing your own intricate knot patterns, we do go over that in detail on our Bochi Knot Macrame community on Patreon. To find out more, you guys can head on over to patreon.com slash Boshing up for more details. As always, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time.